you or your team don't see anything uh, uh, sufficiently UN related to trigger an audit such as was held in the previous case. I don't think I case. said that. But oh, that's, well, that's okay. how I read. All right. All right. Okay. You said no staff members involved. So I have two okay. questions. Number one, C CEFC, China Energy Company, is a member of the Global Compact. And I remember in the, few, right. in the previous case, Sun Kyanip was immediately removed because of the indictment, mm -hmm. even though they weren't named in the indictment. Right. So I'm, again, I'm asking is there's a different standard or some kind of No, I don't think some it's a different standard. I mean, I think uh, obviously this happened uh, very recently over the holidays. We'll check with our global compact people, but I, the policies have not changed and their efforts to, to ensure uh, that companies that are uh, that companies that belong to the Global Compact are up to snuff. Okay, and the other question is, yesterday at the bail hearing for Sheikh Gaudio, it emerged that that uh, the per, per person, one of the four people paying bail, uh, his spouse uh, is the resident rep, is, is a UN official in, uh, in, in Equatorial Guinea. Turns out she's the resident representative. So I wanted to know with all, you know, obviously family values and all, but you'd said that there's no UN staff member involved is paying the bail for an accused briber, does that constitute involved? I, I don't know. I and have, do you I'll think have to check. I'll, I'll have to. Could you I, check I on that? I don't, you get uh, some? I don't uh, doubt the veracity of what you're telling me, uh, but I will just have to check. And I, it goes to this, this question about the, the new indictment and the China Energy uh, uh, Funds Committee. I just saw that on, on, there was an event on November 21st. It was award ceremony for the Powering the Future We Want UN DESA Energy Grant. And that, that grant is entirely funded by China Energy Fund Committee. So I wanted to know, maybe you, I, I know that he's, he's out of town right now, but did he speak at the event? Did no. he, in fact, attend the event? No, he did he, not he attend. He ended up not he attending not speak, the event? He did not participate, yeah. But, so that might be a mistake on, on the, sure. the calendar. I'll, I'll have that looked at. I, absolutely. But could I, I guess I want to ask, because it, it seems like in the wake of that indictment, which it announced the day before, the Secretary General canceled a photo op involving the award. The Deputy Secretary General said she was going to speak and didn't speak there. He was going to attend and apparently didn't attend. I don't want to guess that it had something to do with the indictment. Could you ask him, or to, to, in the spirit of transparency, uh, why he didn't attend the event well, and whether he thinks that event should have gone forward? What I can offer you are, are the facts and the facts are that he did not participate in that event. Uh, that's a mistake on our website and I'll have that clarified. He did not speak at the event. He had nothing to do with that event. Okay. Yes, sir.